Sunday. For a lot of y'all, it might be a rest day. For those that are coming to the gym, it's a pretty simple day today. Again, you can come in and make up your own workout to whatever best fits your needs. Uh, or partner up with some people and come up and have some fun. But we love seeing y'all come up here on these weekends and, and get some work in. Uh, love seeing what y'all come up with. If you want to follow what's put into Sugar Watt, it's a superset. Uh, it's five push press, five push press, doing five by three. Remember, push press is a dip drive. Uh, superset it with a single, with a dumbbell deadlift, single leg. So you can grab one or two dumbbells or kettlebells. I'll stand up on a box here. You want to make sure you start from the top position, kick the leg up, then you go down on the one leg, just to your hands are about knee level and back up. You don't need to try and touch the ground with the dumbbells or kettlebells, all right? You're, you don't have to stretch the hamstring that far. It doesn't benefit. You're just looking for a good pull through that leg. Make sure you're not turning it into a squat, though, but hinging back, coming down, and back up. Uh, and it'll be five each leg. Uh, then you've got five rounds for time. Uh, it's just a good old classic street fight. It is 12 heavy kettlebell swings. Uh, go for as heavy as you can. They don't have to be unbroken. Followed by 40 double unders or 60 single unders. Uh, again, if jump ropes are a problem, you can hop on ski erg and do uh, do seconds, the equivalent, do 40 seconds of, or 30 seconds of ski erg would equal 40 double unders roughly. So you can always do ski erg with that. Uh, but that's Saturday, Sunday's workout for July 16th. I uh, hope y'all are having a great weekend, and we'll see y'all on Monday.